prepare for the TOEFL listening section with this sample lecture on design and function in architecture. Listen to the lecture, answer some questions about it, then check your answers. If necessary, review the lecture to confirm your understanding. Subscribe for more practice lectures on a wide range of academic topics covered in college and university classes. At its core, architecture is the art and science of designing and constructing buildings and other physical structures. It encompasses a wide range of disciplines, including structural engineering, environmental design, urban planning, and interior design, all working together to create spaces that are not only visually appealing, but also functional, sustainable, and meaningful to the people who use them. Let's start by examining the key elements of architectural design. Every architectural project begins with careful consideration of factors, such as site conditions, cultural context, client needs, and budget constraints. Architects must balance aesthetic considerations with practical requirements, ensuring that the final design meets both artistic and functional objectives. One of the fundamental principles of architecture is form follows function, a concept championed by renowned architect Louis Sullivan. This principle emphasizes the importance of designing buildings that are well suited to their intended purpose, with form and aesthetics emerging from the inherent functional requirements of the space. As we trace the evolution of architectural styles throughout history, we encounter a rich tapestry of design movements, each influenced by cultural, social, and technological factors of its time. From the monumental structures of ancient civilizations to the ornate cathedrals of the Middle Ages and the sleek skyscrapers of the modern era, architecture reflects the aspirations, values, and achievements of human civilization. In addition to historical influences, contemporary architects are grappling with pressing challenges such as urbanization, sustainability, and social equity. Sustainable design principles, such as passive solar design, green building materials, and energy efficient systems, are increasingly incorporated into architectural practice to minimize environmental impact and promote resilience in the face of climate change. Furthermore, architecture plays a crucial role in shaping the built environment and fostering community connections. Well-designed public spaces, such as parks, plazas, and cultural centers, serve as hubs for social interaction and civic engagement, enriching the quality of life for individuals and communities alike. One, what is the main purpose of the lecture? Two, what factors are mentioned as key considerations in architectural projects? Three, according to the lecture, who championed the concept of form follows function in architecture? Four, based on the information in the lecture, what can be inferred about the role of architecture? in contemporary society. Five, why does the lecturer mention sustainable design principles, such as passive solar design and green building materials? Six, according to the lecture, what are examples of well-designed public spaces mentioned?
How did it go? Were you able to answer the questions correctly? Share your score in the comments below. Like, comment, and subscribe for more TOEFL listening practice with lectures.